Sexy Red, this rapper who is under a lot of fire recently. You want to know why? Because she was performing at a school. While this is a very, very normal occurrence with up and coming rappers, people who just kind of just get fame and uh, start really getting the attention that they want, they will perform at schools. So why is this such a bad situation right now? Well, this particular artist, she is known for very, very, I would say, crude lyrics. And she's been getting a lot of fire on the Internet, specifically Twitter. Um, people are not liking this. They think it's a very, very bad situation. So before we get really into it, make sure you subscribe to the channel, like the video, comment, share all that great stuff. Specifically, if you like content like this, let's get into it. So, Sexy Red, is it, you know, a lot of rappers have crude lyrics, a lot of rappers have things in their music that, you know, on the surface, you wouldn't want children to listen to. So, why do people care right now? Well, again, she has very, I would say, inappropriate lyrics for kids in her music, um, but I hate to burst people's bubbles that's kind of what rap is specifically right now it's rap isn't for the young minds but we all know the younger people consume it the most it's just something that we are aware of it's it's just clear and i feel like some people take clips and videos out of context really this one okay if you really look at the video break it down you know we're on our real analytical uh detective side uh it doesn't seem as if she performs any of her music there i want to say when the video starts it is a song playing i don't know whose song it is it could be hers but it doesn't sound like anything too inappropriate is performed at the school so that's just the facts of it i know people want to get like really riled up and be like oh well she performed some crazy inappropriate and she's spreading it to high schoolers minds but in reality um, it doesn't seem like that at all. It seems quite the opposite. It seems like they're all excited to see this girl, but nothing is performed, at least in the clip. I don't know what happens after that or before it, but it doesn't seem like anything performed there at the moment of the clip is inappropriate. So that's good, right? That's great. I mean, she's, you know... <laughs> And I saw a great uh, comment, you know, someone said, you guys are acting like they don't listen to her in their spare time, which is facts. I mean, as long as the outlet is there, as long as the opportunity is there and someone likes your music, it's 2023. They're going to find the music. It's, it's, it's you know, what I mean, so many streaming uh, platforms, it's just they're going to find it. It's, it's like the worst kept secret ever. So. Bottom line, I don't I don't have nothing wrong with it. I think it, it's definitely I understand. I'm, I don't want to sound oblivious and be like, well, I don't get why anybody's mad at all. Like, I don't understand. I do understand. I get why people could be mad about this. It's an uh, interesting time in hip hop, um, specifically with uh, female hip hop, female rappers. Uh, it's like a liberation. Everybody's being more free. Everybody's being more open. So I think this idea of of spreading this misinformation or this sort of um, bad information, I guess they would say, toward the young audience is at like an all time high. It's very interesting right now. Um, you know, the Cardi B's, the Megan Thee Stallions, the Lottos, the Ice Spices, people are recognizing that women are running hip hop and a lot of people have an issue with that. So, because again, I, I feel like if a guy performed, you know, Dirk, you know, love Dirk, but Dirk, Dirk goes to schools and Polo G goes to schools and, you know, these guys don't have the absolutely most positive message 100% of the time, but we don't really see them going viral on the internet for performing at this school. And that's just my two cents. I mean, I understand again why people are mad. I'm not oblivious. Oh, yeah. Excuse me, guys. I'm a little bit under the weather. I should have probably started with that. Hmm. But anyway. Yeah, guys, let me know what you guys think. Uh, You know, are you for the culture with this? Do you do you think this is a 
a good testament to where hip hop and I guess the school system is going. I don't know. I, I I'm not really uh, mad at it. I, I, I can see why this happened. I can see again why people are mad. Don't think I'm oblivious. I understand. OK, I get it. But really, it's not that deep. I don't think it's that bad. Again, nothing performed there at the time of the clip uh, seemed that bad. And I know people were like, oh, well, she did like these hand signs and she flipped them off. Like, why is that the first thing she does? Mind you guys, I don't know how old Sexy Red is, but, you know, she she's new to this fame for sure. This is this is just getting to her. She hasn't been famous for like a decade plus. You know, she's not going to act like, I guess, other people who are very, um, very experienced with this level of fame. This is all new to her, too. You know, she just recently popped. Um, she blew up not too long ago. So all I'm saying is maybe some grace. I don't know. But the Internet is a cruel, cruel SOB. So grace will probably not be given. So whatever, you're going to make your own opinions about it. Just let me know in the comment section on how you think about it. Um, Yeah, I mean, what you think about it. And uh, yeah, like the video, subscribe if you're new. And I will see you in the next video because it could possibly be the best video on YouTube. Peace.